Okay, well, I uh, discovered something a ways back, and I'm not sure where I discovered this from, but there's a new solar toy that's probably not a new solar toy called the Solar Tibetan Prayer Wheel. It has a pretty big solar panel, and uh, it has this wheel that you uh, start up and then it turns uh, if you get light on it. And um, what was fascinating to me about it was it's not like the normal solar... Uh, driver circuits or mechanism it's actually a motor with a gear train on it and i did some research and i ordered one and there was a guy his name is gurgurli imra sorry if i didn't pronounce his name right that hacked this and took it apart and um it's called a solar powered tibetan prayer wheel circuit and he got it and he took it all apart and he analyzed he's an engineer and um, in that thing is the um, gear train and the circuit and, and all the guts to it. And he analyzed it, and then he had help um, figuring out the circuit. That's the coil. It's like a bifiler coil with fine wire. And um, he hacked it and figured out what it was and then posted the circuit diagram with an explanation of what it is. It's an A-stable multivibrator um, turned into a pulse driver circuit. And so I thought I might have a go at trying to replicate that. And I, I did, but I didn't. Um, my circuit is slightly different, but it is an A-stable multivibrator pulse motor driver circuit that uh, you'll have to take a look at it and see. But uh, there it is running. Uh, on a watch battery and it runs pretty darn good now I've separated the coils on the uh, prayer wheel the the coils are bifiler and they're wound together but uh, I haven't taken mine apart yet you can take it apart it just unscrews but I don't want to break it and uh, it took forever to get this from Taiwan or ever, wherever they sent this from but Anyway, this is um, an A-stable multi-vibrator pulse driver circuit that I have not seen before. And it, um, this particular one I've got is drawn about 10 milliamps on a volt and a half. Um, it's just a, a standard uh, flip-flop multi-vibrator circuit with a couple of variations going on here. Um, this is really the drive coil. This, I believe, is like a sense coil that triggers the thing. But I tried all the different kinds of things, and this is the only thing I could get to work. And it's a variation of that circuit there. And I didn't have to use that because I'm not using a solar panel on it. If you had the solar panel, you really need a capacitor to store the energy. And then over here, this is a RF noise suppression capacitor that you don't really need. Now these prayer wheels, they uh, put them on the dashboard of their cars over there. And I think that's to keep the radio from picking up the blink, blink, blink of the uh, the circuit as it goes on. But anyway, I just want to share that with people that uh, this was uh, my Tibetan prayer wheel replication of the circuit. Thanks for watching.